Hey fam, I'm at the Museum of Broadway. I hope you're excited to see it. This is my first time here. Let's go. So, this is from the third floor. You start on the third floor and then you go down from here. Landmark laws were enacted 
to protect the remaining Broadway houses. In the mid-90s, Disney signed a 99-year lease on the long-neglected New Amsterdam Theater on 42nd Street. The city cleaned up Times Square, and it became vibrant and tourist-friendly once again. Over the last two decades, Broadway's theaters have been constantly filled, and there's even a waiting list for incoming shows. In 2020, due to the COVID-19 pandemic, Broadway shut down for its longest period of time to date. After 18 months, Broadway reopened and the city's heartbeat began pulsing again. Broadway remains one of the top reasons people come to New York City. Thank you for visiting the Museum of Broadway. We hope you enjoy your time here and that you leave with a new and exciting appreciation for the wonderful world of Broadway. Now, that was a short film, and now we're going into a self-guided tour of the... What is this area representing? Uh, well, the Follies area. So it's like a precursor to Broadway. Okay. That's just the Follies. Ah. Like what Chicago was like? The play? Like how the play was? Follies and stuff? Yeah, it was like different little showcases. Kind of like vaudeville. Yeah. In a way. Just a little more upscale. It's a different like, variety acts. Also known for the showgirls, so Fanny Price being the most famous one, Picture Center, and those are actual Father's Chorus Girls costumes. Okay. Nice. You're an actor? Mm -hmm. You are? Yeah. Broadway? Not yet. Not yet? Okay. Trying to get there? Mm -hmm. Sing? Dance? Sing and dance. Sing and dance, okay. No dancing yet? Come on now. You got to... <laughs> All right. Which is cheaper, acting classes or um, dancing? Sorry? Which is cheaper, acting or dancing classes? They all are in different prices. Yeah, depending on where you go? We'll probably say dance costs are a little more cost friendly. Okay. Same thing, the Follies? This is Showboat. So this is one of the earliest storybook musicals that we know today. Okay. Nice. Musical. Yeah. 
see is made out of the paper material to show show both to show that it was one of the earliest examples of the storybook musical. That dress, however, is from the 90s production. The character was uh, Rebecca Lukers. She was a Broadway actress who sadly passed away a few years ago. What, what Broadway show? Uh, Showboat. Showboat, the okay. Showboat. Nice. All right, so uh, uh, and your name, sir? Christian. Christian. All right. Next big star. You saw it here first.
appropriately taught So that was the third floor. It is taking you on a journey throughout the decades of Broadway. Now, you start on the third floor, then you go down to the other floors below it. And so, what do you think so far? 
it is amazing so far and it's really taking you on a journey for what Broadway was to what Broadway is now. Let's continue on to the second floor.
So that was the second floor. We're getting ready to go to the first floor. I hope you are enjoying the journey, taking you through the years. You see how many different things and how many different Broadway plays, the costumes. And you'll see that they focus on certain plays specifically and others they may make mention of, the producers, the directors. So phenomenal so far, I'm going downstairs, continue on with this journey.
So that was the last of it. I like the fact that on this first floor, they really honored the people that paved the way for these shows, the lighting, the costume, the people who do the makeup. I really love that fact. I love this museum. I hope you love the tour. Can you do me a favor, family? Can you like, comment, and subscribe? Click on the notification bell to be informed of future posts. It will greatly help my channel. And guess what, family? It is free of charge to do so. I'm going to go check out right now the gift shop. I'm going to show you a little bit of the gift shop. But until next time, thank you for coming on. Happy travels.